Hi guys, Buck is back again. This, I believe, will go in as part four. Um, maybe it might be less parts if I learn how to edit on PC, but I don't see that happening anytime soon. Uh, so in between the ending of filming, I looked up, they haven't posted any more codes on their Instagram for Character Unlocked, but as you notice, I've got two more here. So you can get it, A, they'll slowly posting it on Instagram. Uh, B, if you buy the actual bags of Chex Mix, there's different, the different flavors are different kinds, basically. Like, uh, each one has a different character, um, for basically unlock code in it, but they're also releasing it on the Chex Quest website. If you go to the characters, um, they, I, when I checked just a little bit ago, Whitney and Shane's codes were available on there, so I went ahead and put them in. So, since we're already playing as Fred, we're actually gonna switch it up. Let's just start with... Uh, this is pretty much just a female version, so actually I want to see what how different this guy is. He's, I wonder if he's like shorter or something, so let's try Shane. Wait, see to... Oh, so each character has its own different progress. Because you see here we got right here 54 out of 57. But if we go here, nothing. So each character has progress on. Okay, that's cool. So now I guess we're gonna keep playing this Fred then. So back to storage facility. This ain't my first level. Hmm, it's big. It's got four walls, a ceiling, a floor. This must be a big room. Now I did say that I wasn't gonna reshow footage from things I already passed. But I'm gonna, I wanna try to do a solid let's play with no cuts, you know, like actually show me working through it instead of just showing me successfully working through it. So as long as this works, I'll just keep doing a normal let's play. Um, if it cuts footage, in which case I won't. But let's hope it just doesn't cancel my recording randomly again. Okay, so how did we do this last time? Make a little hop. Made too much of a hop. And I want some more too much of a hop. Come on, third time's a charm. There we go. You need to see if this has controller support. That might make things a bit easier for some of the platforming. Oh, there's not much of that, so I probably really don't need to. So, nothing else in here. Where do I go then? Oh, duh, I just got the blue key card, so I'll go into... Nobody As you can tell, I took a momentary break from the game, hence why I don't remember. Because if you're watching the let's play, you would have just saw me go through this area. I promise my memory's not that level of bad. Also, I just not noticed that green bar is actually like an or like a ammo type slider, like how much power it has. So I shoot too many off in a row, apparently. It'll, it'll stop working now, this at least for a time. If it's that dangerous, it must be the way. Time to climb aboard. Okay. Still not quite sure which items give us armor. It doesn't seem like we've been getting too much of that. This milk could spoil. I better get it out of here. So this is apparently milk. This is a research or this is a warehouse actually. Or is this a research facility? I think the last one was a research facility. There appears to be even more dairy.
I hate to waste all this protein. Last one. Success. I feel so.
Yes. Good. This ain't my first level. Hmm, it's big. It's got four walls. A ceiling, a floor. This must be a big room. He's indoors. That's what the people want. Zorch! Zorcher! Zorchus! <laughs> Normally, I prefer the stairs. For the purpose. This is my kind of torture. If it's that dangerous, it must be the way. Time to climb aboard. <coughs> this milk could spoil. I better get it out of here. On the right track. There appears to be even more dairy. I hate to waste all this protein. Last one. A bit soggy for my taste.
success. Safety first. This ain't my first level. Hmm, it's big. It's got four walls, a ceiling, a floor. This must be a big room. Freeze platform. Zorch! Zorcher! Zorchus! <laughs> Normally I prefer the stairs. Possible, but I feel stronger. <laughs> now, this it's is not dangerous, kind of it must be the way. Time to climb aboard. This milk could spoil. I better get it out of here. On the right track.
Safety first. There appears to be even more dairy. I hate to waste all this protein. Last one. Success.
Man, Man I love adventures. adventures. they did like a cereal pack in of this. Everything's available digital nowadays and prior to what I like and think is better, uh, digital is quite popular anyway and arguably overtaking physical games. So I guess this makes sense for today's media, but it'd be cool since it's like a remake and like to make it more like authentic and classic if they re-release it like actually in boxes too. Or did some sort of like limited run giveaway or something. Alright, so I just, do I just go back to the elevator and go back down to the next area, I'm guessing? What did I say? A blue? Why is it not working again? It would be cool if they added a, I know there was like a fan made like, third game, or like a Shex Quest 3 they had on their website last year, I don't know, well, I don't know if it was fan or what, but it's weird because you had to like go from the website and mess with files and stuff, it wasn't like a full release, but this is a full release, you know, remake of the uh, original, so I wonder if they like update it, because they added the new characters for multiplayer, so like they'll probably do bug fixes, you know, Make sure it's running smoothly, but I wonder if like they'll add new levels or uh, like add a GM type game mode or something, or like just like actual PVP multiplayer. That'd be really cool, but I doubt they'll do that. They could though, because they uh, could do like host servers. Um, cause obviously I don't think they're gonna do dedicated servers. They're not a gaming like company or anything, but they could. They could do something like that. It'd be cool. so far, so we're probably going to get wrecked at some point. That or sometimes there is just harder missions than others. But it's also more maze-like, and now we can't find my way out. Uh, no, that's the way I went down. This should be the exit. Am 
might have to split this level up even if I do do it first try because videos already run around a half hour. Did with my McDonald's Wi-Fi, that's pretty much an overnight upload. I uh, I know usually can't see videos. I think went for basically an overnight. Hence why I don't stream often, I try to time the time, and I get like a solid 20 minutes of kinda leggy but like, decent stream, and then it just dies. Yeah. <laughs> you probably turn it on with that, I would guess. Ah! That's actually hurting my ear, that like weird staticky sound. Oh, it like went on my camera thing again. What the heck? It keeps going like out of game. It's not letting me fire. There we go. I also now, now notice there's a green flash on the edge of your screen when you get hit. good with my directions. Are we a red area? Yeah, so it looks like the slime repellent is the armor. But it's only in, uh, one, so I haven't found anything big. I do enjoy this game, and I like the art style and stuff. It's just weird. I just don't know, like, like the artwork too is cool, but like the, uh, 3D character models, like at the end screen, I don't know, look, at least, uh, Fred is the only one I've seen so far, and he's looking a little funky in the face. Well, exit facility. So once again, we didn't find any secrets, sadly, but we did sort 98% and found 79% items. So let's actually... Turn the menu here. Let's see how far we got so far. So, yeah. So it looks like these are actually, so it's less than I thought it was originally. I thought it was like different areas, but no, it just straight takes you into the different missions or levels. So, we did landing zone, did a storage facility, did laboratory, so we got Apertome or something, and then Caverns of Bazook. Looks like we got two more levels left, and then after that, I mean, play on the different characters, and then I guess go back and find the secrets, or play multiplayer. But, I mean, we're getting pretty close there, we're over halfway through. Um, I still don't quite understand how the multiplayer works. If someone would know, you know, that'd be appreciated if they could comment down below. Let me do a quick check here. So down here it says redeem code, uh, where you employ code. Um... Uh, I am checking to see if there's any new codes here to give you like guys an example of what it looks like. Doesn't look like there is, but I'll just like input uh, one to show you. So this is just a Fred multiplayer unlock code. D2, uh, AF lowercase, 3, capital W. And then, yeah, that's, that's just that for that. And like I said, uh, you see here the Wheatney and Shane also I have unlocked on the menu, so they're available over on CheckQuest.com. But yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed the series so far, and then I'll see you in the next part. Bye.